Yeah, this Jay-Z apartment right here. You know, it's one way in, one way out. We're not like the other projects. Cops evil, creeping on, creep on the roof. Come through, switch sides on you if you ain't paying attention. You switching the name to Wall Street. It's different. Before it was really, really dangerous. There was no kids outside playing. A lot of money get made, and a lot of people change. You feel me? But look, we gonna stay the same way. Rap music got these kids' brains messed up because they don't tell them about when they stepping inside a prison. What's going on guys? It's a beautiful day out here in Brooklyn with the Marcy Houses. I hope you guys are going to enjoy this video. What's up man? It's your boy Young Los. We out here at Marcy Projects right here by the original Marcy sign. You might recognize it from uh, from Drake's video. We're going to take y'all on a little tour right now. There's two sides of the project. Right now we on um, Jay-Z's side. It's called um, Shame World, you feel me? Back in the days, the kids ain't really have all of this, but they could come outside and play right in front of the buildings. Look at now, it's much different. Before it was really really dangerous. There was no kids outside playing. I'm originally from downtown, South Brooklyn. You already know. If you know, you know. You know what I mean? I ain't got to talk too much. Silence is golden, you feel me? But I've been out here for mad years doing whatever, man. I feel like the neighborhood hero every day, you heard? This the little bro. I watch all of them grow up. They watch me come up, know what I mean? Sherwin-Will's infamous. You see the fashion, you see the drip, you see y'all be out here. You know what we doing out here. We getting money out here. We switching the name to Wall Street. Mm -hmm. so stay Wall Street. tuned, you heard? Stay Black tuned. Wall Street. BWS. For y'all niggas that really know. it's up, man. I, underdog. We all a bunch of underdogs, you know, up and coming. Uh oh, you know what I'm saying? They under Different type of drip, you feel me? They underestimate us. So we gotta show the world, you know, how we can make a change. Well, I start today if I might win tomorrow. Over here, this is where Hov shot his brother at and shit. This source money building right here too. You know source money. Mm -hmm. he, he still pop out here sometimes. Like source that. money from this building right here. This was source yeah. money from uh, fourth floor. Uh, J from five five thirty six. You know what I'm saying? Bleak. But this right here is where the stars from. We just yeah. been through a lot out here, man. It's man, hard, no. man. Just glad to be no. here. Yeah. These my niggas, man. I watched them grow up. These my bros, man. Marcy that's B's, a, man. A, Much a, love. Man. Solid. See Playground called Blueberry. That's, I mean, that's what the hood named it. Uh, it one way in, one way out. We have basketball tournaments here, like once in the summer and shit like that. I mean, it'd be lit. We got the bleachers here. It'd be packed right here, you feel me? It'd be, it'd be no space to stand. When, when that, that crazy tournament a few summers ago, it was yeah, a crazy man. tournament out here. A couple of kids got hit. Got up hit. And shit. Yeah, man. Yeah. Young kids, about like couple what, of, man, 16, yeah. 15. Yeah. And they just, you know, coming around with, they, they wasn't even from here, you know? They came around, they came to the show, the basketball thing. This whole building, Jay Z building and shit. It's where a lot of shit went down, a lot of drug dealing, a lot of clapping. We're in front of the spot, 534 flushing. We're about to go in the hallway real quick. Some of these still over Uh huh. Are you on the fifth floor, though? Yo, low. Yeah, you see these elevators are small as shit, man. So furniture-wise and shit, you know what I mean? We have a hard time with that. Yeah, this Jay-Z apartment right here. Around Christmas time, we used to come through here, uh, give our presents by the center. Right in the corner, this man behaving, lives over here and shit. This right here, man, aka Headache. They used to get money and shit, him and Hove. Then, you know, shit happens. But it's still, it's all love, though. This is it, you feel me? It's just the hood right here. When Jay-Z was out here, he used to be out here all day, knock on this window. That's for that money. Like, they, they know that call out here. That They coming out here. They, they know that call. It was very dangerous out here. Like, you had to watch. You know, you had to look out this window like this and all that. To see who out there. And you had to watch the roof. You had to hear from the roof. It's crazy yeah. about how we move. You know, it's one way in, one way out. We not like the other projects. Cops evil, creeping on, creep on the roof, come through, switch sides on you if you ain't paying attention, you mm -hmm. feel me? But now that the, the marijuana shit legal, it's like, it's, 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 it's a little different with that now, you feel me? You still can't smoke out here, though. Yeah, you still can't smoke, but yeah, like, police used to be real, be real greasy, like, they'll come and try to catch you in any way they can. Still stopping frisk, don't get it twisted. They still running down on us and shit. It's just the blue and whites don't do it as often. It's like more yeah. detectives, you feel me? The detectives just jump out on you, see what mm -hmm. you got, but they ain't really looking for no, like, no weed or anything like that. They just, they just they just want guns. If you got weed on you, they'll let you go. If you got a gun, you out of here. When you carry, carry smart. Be smart. You know, police will try to outthink you. And you know, we ain't trying to have them overpower us. And the system is just corrupt. You know what I mean? So, gotta stay aware. 
You get three and a half if it's your first charge. Now, if you get if you get another charge behind that, you get five, seven, whatever, whatever comes with that. You know, we don't have enough space in these hallways. You hang out in these hallways, and if you got problems with anybody, you gotta keep eyes on the windows, eyes for for the for the police. They like to the cross rooms and all that. So it's really cautious. You gotta be real cautious hanging out in these hallways. And you see us, how we out here, like ten of us. 11 of us, that's how you get run down on. We all trying to stick together and move around and stay united. A lot of young kids out here that, you know, they, they trying to build their reputation and make sure that they good in this environment. So at times it get, it get real dangerous, but it won't be the older heads like that. It'll be more of the younger guys, you know, like, but hey, man, we here to support them however way we can, man. You know, we teach them the ropes. If they want to take it, they take it. If not, hey man, that's on them, bro. Hopefully they ready for this, for this lifestyle, if that's what they want to take. But other than that, you know, we show you, we gonna show you all the ways, man. We about to head over to Park Ave now. Park Ave is real, real dangerous before back in the days, you know what I mean? And we gonna spin over there and show y'all how that go. Most of us over here from Park Ave too, so we gonna, we gonna go and tell y'all how we grew up on our circle back yeah, we just, from we the just, 90s to... We just want to give you a little whole, a whole spin through the hood real quick. Yeah, I mean, give you a little, a little main spot. show y'all like how it was from going up in the 90s. Like, you see the buildings now, they got ramps and stuff like that. You see the rams and stuff like that? We ain't had that before. We had like... We had like, what, six steps to come inside the building? We had no ramps and nothing. This was open field. I mean, we didn't have none of this before. Like, we had this yellow bar at the entrance, we used to close the yellow bar, and um, no police could come in here, no cars could come in the project before. You know, so now, police sleep in the projects. The hood is, is big, and I mean, this is just one side we showed you so far, and we still have a whole nother other side. Yeah, that's the Pfizer building. If you're from the projects, you can go in there, and they'll hook you up with a job through like a program. I forgot the name of the program, but they go a lot of- Job first. Yeah, job first. They go, they go a lot of opportunities to people right from the projects that live in the projects that you can go there, you can help you up with some. They help you up with some work. This side right here, we call it the lot. You feel me? Where well, you see a lot. Seen a dude get hit over here last year. You feel me? Other than that, though, you feel me? It's the money side. You feel me? We just get to it. Try to keep shit moving. You feel me? Stay positive and stay out the way. But I'm gonna just show you a little bit of what I got out today. You feel me? Like I said, it's the money side. I just seen a lot of videos get shot over here. A lot of money get made. And a lot of people change, you feel me? But look, we gonna stay the same way. Vanguard Center, they used to take care of us. Free lunch, we used to go after school. We used to have things to do. They used to have games here. They even let us throw parties. Late night too. We had, there's a whole bunch of stuff over here, but we, we it made boys and some men, definitely. Every little section we took you to, like that, that we gave you a name for, every section be lit, you feel me? Everybody got their own, their own little sections, their, their own little people, their own styles. But we all fuck with each other, you feel me? At the end of the day, that's why that's why I want you to show you how, 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 that's where the how dice everything Olympics looking. Be, feel yeah, me? the dice Come Olympics. Lose your money, uh -huh. yeah. earn some, win some. Yeah, Park Ave, man. This is where it's, this where it's at, man. Shout out my boy Zion Meek. He started some shit out here called Club Park Ave. You know what I mean? You gotta be having this shit lit. Yeah, this NA Rock right here, aka Gangland. Word. It go down over here. Get crazy. If you go up the street, uh, heading down this way on on Notion Ave. Like a block or two up, you'll see like a whole Jewish community. We call it Juice Town. They safe, nobody bothered them. And it's just like that, you feel me? So like, we just not gonna live together, I guess. Cause it's like, they, they basically buying up the surrounding areas of the projects. Even the cameras around here, they wasn't always here, you feel me? They just put them up a couple years ago. I mean, they, they wasn't always here, like. And even in, even in the projects, like we don't have no cameras in our buildings, you feel me? That's like the project, probably the only projects with no cameras in the building. Like the other projects, Tompkins, they got cameras all through their shit. Even on a, even walking through the lanes, you'll see cameras in their shit. We ain't got that out here. Right now, we on Notion Avenue, right across the street from the projects. Uh, you see, we got we got a whole bunch of delis right here. We got one behind you. We got another deli right here. And we got another deli up here. So it's like, there's always shit to eat. You feel me? You come, you come from school, <laughs> you be fucking shit up, you know what I mean? Get you a hair roll, something, whatever you want to get, bacon, egg, and cheese, chopped cheese, whatever, you feel me? We got good memories and bad memories. But I had some bad memories over here. Every time I lost my good brother right here, my big bro, Popcorn. It's a touchy situation because this right over here is where I lost my brother at. Like, this the, to this day, this is the first time I really had the opportunity to ask somebody where 
the situation happened with my brother at because I never was able to put a candle here because I was incarcerated when that took place. But this way I lost my brother and his girlfriend at right here on Popcorn and Joycelyn. Rest in peace Rest to the both peace. of them. Like, and it's like every time you got to come up and down this mm -hmm. avenue right here, it's touchy to a lot of people that he was a positive influence in their life looking out for them helping them out so like that's a touchy situation right there so I mean I just want to say rest in peace to my brother and Joycelyn I mean y'all forever gonna be in our lives y'all gonna forever, forever be with us like y'all always in our hearts and mm -hmm. I mean we're gonna keep on going through y'all man y'all keeping Facts. us strong out here a lot of people died out here it used to be a mirror over here with a lot of names how much names it was about it was a whole bunch like about 300 names. We on a positive note right now, this project. This project is nothing like what it used to be. The difference between yesterday and today is the difference of respect from the kids. You don't get it like you used to get it. You know what I mean? But you gotta get older people to teach the younger people how this works, man. But a lot of them don't have that mentality on how to respect people. But they don't respect themselves, you know what I mean? But other than that, the projects are smooth, you know? It is what it is. It's my home, you know what I mean? It takes a village to raise one of these kids, boy. There's a bunch of people in here. Yeah, yeah we got a village full. We got a village full. A lot of people don't got no positive, positive uh -huh. influence in their life. You know what I mean? So they come outside and see stuff going on and they want to do that. Or uh, listening to rap music. You understand what I'm saying? A lot of rap music got these kids' brains messed up because they don't tell them about when they stepping inside a prison. You understand what I'm saying? I did 15 years up north, so I know how it is to be from chilling out here to being in there. This whole community is cleaning up, it's changing. A lot of things is going on, a lot of things is different. Like, it, it, it comes with the negative, comes with the positive. It's a lot that comes out of here, man. Like, this whole block is what I was talking about with the Jews and all that. Like, they like they basically got this whole situation right here. And the situations around, like, even the soil building right there, that's all Jewish owned, so like, Definitely. you feel me? He, he back here all on flush, and he's like his own all this shit back here. One of my mans, he's not here right now, my boy Q Gambino, you know what I mean? He's launched his own drink, you know what yeah. I mean? So I, I, I just, I just want to show you how much the hood support, you know what I mean? We got them in the stores. The other store on the other corner, we got them too over there. Right. Bino's Lemonade, all independent. And we also have the, the, uh, the lemon iced tea, you feel me? So we just trying to turn a negative into a positive, you feel me? Trying to trying to do us, you feel me? I'm gonna go purchase these right here because they good. You want to shit? Yeah, we got to let go, go, go support, man. It's, it's in there? The it's in there, it's in the stores. Wait, that's, that's the lemonade? That's the lemonade, I we got the lemon iced tea, tea, man. Yeah, man. I get that one like, shit too. Man. I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. This, this really good, so I ain't just saying it because it's my man's shit, man. It's, it's good. If you see here, it got like all the train stations that, that's, that's that's local that's, here. That's in so the sky, the yeah. The J and the Z train right there, you know, that's how Jay-Z got his name. Two years ago, it wasn't looking like this. It, it was uh, it was like completely different. It was not the same as how it looked now. I believe uh, Tracy Morgan is definitely the behind this right here. This change is because is of Tracy Morgan. As you've seen, the last OG post on the gate, you feel me? So, it's like... Definitely. It's, it's, look, it's looking different. It's like it's, it's upgrading. Tracy Slow, Morgan was definitely over here. Yeah, slowly but surely, it's, it's, it's getting a little upgrade. As soon as the park got lit, my son Tracy Morgan definitely pop out. Ain't he from Tonkin? Yeah, he's from Tonkin. Yeah. He's from Tonkin. Yeah. yeah. It's a lot of talent. So they said it's so a part of housing. Yeah. That's a lot it. of roses so in like, the concrete out there. So like, That's um, definitely it. They say like he wasn't able to change his projects, his courts, because it's a part of housing. But this is not part of housing. This is like a uh, public. public park. So that's why he was able to do something for us. And still, and still keep it close, you feel me? Because we right. just a block away. And the kids love it out here too, man. Yeah, mm -hmm. community thing, man. It make you them know? feel like they in 2K, you feel me? They you get to customize their court. Like, oh, yeah. the kids, man. This is one guy right here. He deal with the kids in the community with the basketball. Oh, yeah. What's happening? We big just, facts. Uh, he from Marcy. He's trying to give back. He's trying to take all the kids out of there to get them into the league. Speak about it. Speak about what you do. Hey, from my building. Youth basketball coach, mentor. You know what I mean? Just trying to do my part, pay it forward. I got a boy. I got a boy in my hole. It's, like I said, it's just love, man. It's just love. We just trying to bring it back. Um, it's our time. It's a new era. You know what I mean? Black culture, and we and we got to go up. It's the only one way to go. We're going to the top, but it starts with our youngest, man. Right. And all these guys right here, we gotta. We, we know where we came from. There was some OGs that, that supported us. You know what I mean? In, in a different way. So we just got to give it back. I mean, two ten times, hundred times better. Get right. International D on the check-in, man. Family, brotherhood, brotherhood. All walks of life, 
same song. We're trying to give the Chicago kids an opportunity to come out to New York and play street ball where it ain't big like that. And we're trying to bring New York kids out there to rock in Chicago where they do a lot of AU in-house stuff. So that's the goal, man. So right here, you got the projects, you feel me? And then across the street, we got a lot of new developments that they brought up, you know, in the past couple years. Same way right here, a new development right there used to be Cascade, you know, it used to be a big laundry mat. Used to pass that every day when I used to walk to school, you feel me? But you know, it's good to see them bring, bringing new developments to the neighborhood, you know? Yeah, bringing like some beautiful features make, to the neighborhood. Making it more diverse. And you can see they, have, they even have balconies and yeah. everything like that over here. This side is the fastest way to get to uh, Myrtle, Myrtle Avenue side. The G train right here is the fastest way to get to Marcy, period. And on the other side is the G train on the same corner, on the corner straight down. It's on Flushing side, so you can you, you got two choices. It's a quicker way to get to either side you want to go to. That's train in Brooklyn. Yeah, this summer is actually on the news. If you want to, uh, you, you can Google it, uh, Myrtle. Myrtle Avenue G train. I don't want to get into that situation, but yeah, like something unfortunate happened here. This is the fastest way you can get to like downtown Brooklyn, Manhattan. For me, without taking a bus, you could just get here and transfer to the A train, and you're good to go basically anywhere you want to go. You feel me? It's Tompkins right here, where Tracy Morgan from. We came down here to Marcy to help us out. He couldn't really do it in Tonkins because they house it in our park is a city park, so it was easier and shit. You, you can see the difference between how tall their buildings are and how tall our buildings are. Yeah, we, yeah. we only got six floors. They got like what? I don't even I don't even know. So like 15, 16. But I don't want to get the number wrong. Like I'm, I mean they got a lot more than us though. Marcy Ave right here. Marcy Ave, the living room. Come out here. Late now you don't know what you might see out here. Most foot traffic. <laughs> you can go over there and get you a sandwich from the Ox. My son Juan Dito will hook it up in the morning. You feel me? Uh -huh. And if you want to go over there, we got the liquor store. My son Ugly, you feel me? Bottles for the low. But yeah, it's lit over here. Every night is a movie. Yeah, man. Right here, you got the Hamptons. And then they refer to right here as the living room. The living room. They can say, stop playing. <laughs> and then one thing about Marcy too, like if you notice, it's like a lot of stores. I showed you three on the on, on the other side, and there's three more right here. So we don't really be having to really leave too much. I guess that's what I guess that's the objective of it. You feel me? There's, there's another store right there too. You feel me? So we just like we got like seven stores around here. Yeah, this is the, this is the living room right here. We enter, man. And then we go this way. It's, it's the Hamptons again. You know, where the honeys and shit be at. Like I said, if you notice, they got their own little name. Like, before we was on Sherman World, then we took you to Park Ave, P89, and now we in the Hamptons, you feel me? <laughs> so, a, a, a Park got their own little section, their own style, and their own little groups. Started getting real nasty out here. We could have showed you more, but fortunately we can't. Shout out to you for coming out here, you know what I mean? It's been all love, you know what I mean? Shout out to everybody that was in the video. Shout out to everybody that's not here, that was supposed to be here. Shout out to Underdog Clothing. Shout out to my boy Q and Bino. Shout out, shout out to Young Kyle too, you know what I mean? That's another one that, I mean, another artist that do his thing out here, you know what I mean, for years, you know what I mean? Um, Tev Webb, you know what I mean? Hey, shout out to everybody who's doing something out here, for real, man. Thank you guys for watching. Big shout out to everybody in the video. Shout out to Brooklyn. Shout out to Mars Houses. Shout out to everybody out here for showing so much love. It's a lot going on. You know, you know. Marcy Projects is a wicked ass place.